Our careers, in summary. Yes. This is episode 21. Andrew, what time is it? Also... It's time to kiss my... the slime. I don't... I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. You have a dirty little secret to tell us. Tell us your dirty little secret, Baxter. Friends... I've done a bad thing. <laughs> I broke the rules. Ugh, this guy's breaking all the rules. Directly into my face with no tic tac. But <laughs> after we lost this douche, douche nozzle last time, I was compelled to go to the Earthbound Wiki and find out what the deal is. Infidel! <laughs> I can't believe you! Don't lie to me. Get out of here! Come on, Mrs. Grow. Does this guy want to fight me, or does he want me to get in his van? <laughs> <laughs> Belch, you're freaking me out here, buddy. Also, seriously, what time is it? Oh, that's a good point. It is currently... 10.46. So we will go until 11.15. Roger. Alright, so... Here's the, uh, here's the thing I've done. Give us a lay down. I don't... I'm sitting up. Lay on me, scat cat. I... You're, t you're telling me to do a lot of conflicting things that I'm not sure about. At any rate, I read the article on that wiki about Master Belch, and I discovered that in, in my incredible stupidity, I forgot that we had the jar of fly honey, and used <laughs> that to do this. That absolutely useless piece of rubbish that we collected hours ago. <laughs> Oh great! Everyone in this in this facility keeps telling us, "Hey, you don't fly, honey. You know that's Master Belch's favorite." And we're all like, "You idiot! <laughs> fly, honey's absolutely useless. We're gonna have this stuck in our inventory for the rest of our lives. I'm gonna be buried with this fly, honey." <laughs> I use this fly honey to kill a man in Nam. Uh, I wonder if in this world you drag a dead body around, if you can use that dead body's inventory, and if it you can arrange it so that <laughs> the efficiency of dragging around a dead body is less than, or I mean is greater than the efficiency of dragging around all those objects alone. This is the worst thing <laughs> that has ever happened. Alright, Robsy used that secret herb. The belt lost his mind! <laughs> he's all he's all effed up on fly honey. He is freaking out. <laughs> there is so. no telling what he's gonna do. We're hoping it's something in the vein of honey. fall over and <laughs> give up. <laughs> Just bring me some more of this fly honey and you can do whatever you want, kid. <laughs> Bye, huh? Maybe you should be asking these bosses about that meteor. Or maybe about <laughs> that bee. Is, is there an interrogate option? Rob Z can spy on him. Burn him! How long has... How long has this slime, sentient slime puddle been in this, you know, industrial facility anyway? I mean, does oh. he even know about the meteor? That's, Is he even part of this? That's it? Fly, honey, man. The great a... panacea. <laughs> oh, oh so no. he's in a league with Gigas. Gigas. The Manny Manny statue. Manny Manny statue. The an evil in worse condition. Ew. And that's the worst possible <laughs> thing. Suffer, Spanky. <laughs> <laughs> and then he died. Those were his he last flashed words. Flashed out of existence. <laughs> 
I set him on fire with my telekinesis. Oh. Not more of these douchebags. Okay, let him have it. Hey, check out this music, though. I feel suitably triumphant. <laughs> I escaped! Whoa! It also looks kind of like I assumed. <laughs> this dude needs to just... Look, Mr. S Mr. Saturn, I need you to ease it back about 1,100 notches. For real. <laughs> Oh. I'm glad that hallway was so long. I'm glad we had to walk over multiple screens to get from one side of this hallway to the other. <laughs> Purely to talk to two of these. <laughs> Stinky! Pay you! This guy sound like Gomer Pyle. <laughs> Alright, Goob. You, 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 you stay on that. What? Oh. That one's it. Oh, you're up at the top level now. <laughs> yeah, shake it. Shake it, weird duck. What's up with this pink water? Oh god, there's two of them now. We will never survive. Let's pray we don't have to fight that. <laughs> no, Mr. Saturn, you don't understand. What's up? Okay, Go what's up in with this hot spring? Small lake. <laughs> Wash barf off you body. <laughs> it sounds like a Wash great place to go when you're hungover. Your body, huh? Wash barf off your body. Oh! What? Is this... Could it be... A cinematic? Oh my... Uh, oh! Okay, all I did on. was drink coffee. We beat the game. Oh, well, great. Not True. really that far. I mean... Like, yeah, we've been playing for quite a few hours, but... In the grand scheme of things, we we probably get back there in and... oh, ten <laughs> The worst person. Do you remember how long your winding your journey was? I wouldn't say I've been doing a lot of thinking, buddy. Who is oh boy, have I. Is this the coffee I'm drinking that's talking to me? Mr. Saturn. It, it who was, was only 20% coffee. <laughs> it was almost entirely acid. Yeah. Sulfuric acid. <laughs> Rub Z is with you as well. <laughs> Oh yeah, and Rob Z was there. <laughs> <laughs> you can see him right there in the background. You have an awesome destiny to fulfill. Oh no. The journey <laughs> from this point will be long? Uh, Tell me part of the journey is retracing our steps back home. In the battle's evil, which side did you believe wins? Who is I? Who's saying this? <laughs> A bee. I am not. Okay, so... Everything but a bee? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's One a, thing you it's must never weird. lose is courage. Another thing you must never lose is your mind. Also, you your keys. you end up like that slime beast. <laughs> Probably best not to lose your lunch, either. Yes. In fact, just don't lose anything. Tape it all to your body. <laughs> After this cup of coffee, we're gonna cross the desert. Sounds like a plan. 
poor side. What do you bet the people on poor side are giant tetrahedrons? I'll take that bet. They're all like that diamond monster from Evangelion. We bring up that show a lot. It's a good show. Yeah. It's also culturally significant to nerds. Yes. How long is this supposed to go on? Oh. Uh, exactly that long. Oh. Well. Drinking again. No! No! Why you say no? Uh -huh. A giant dog appears this time. Oh god. This was a terrible idea. Listen to that noise. <laughs> Why do we do things like this? There's three of us. Not one of you advised against doing this. <laughs> Why ladder. do I even have you two along with me? Whole milky well. What? Uh. What? This I'm re I'm really thing. I'm I'm ready to leave Saturn. I'm starting to hate this place. Oh yeah, uh. I like that place. Go back. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh oh god, dang it! Do it, man. Vomit, vomit, vomit. vomit. I don't vomit, know where vomit. this is going. <laughs> What? You better not be selling these pictures to, you know, play off bin. color. <laughs> pretty good. Is that original? Did you just come up with that? Yeah, I just, I just pulled that into my extremely large butt. Uh, we need to go call our mom. Right. Yeah, good idea. Lars is. Before we get involved with some kind of cactus man. <laughs> uh, hey everybody. Ugh, I need to call my mom. Yes, I'm homesick. Oh, yes. Hooray! Jackass. What about these other kids? Do they ever have to call their parents? No. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> Onward. The discussion. All right, we're gonna do some housekeeping here. Uh, Not in this house. Go back to your own house. I will keep house wherever I think it's necessary to keep house. God, dang it. Uh, oh no, wrong button. In my opinion, keeping this house means leveling it and building a new house. <laughs> this house can never be in order. It must be destroyed. Uh, let's see. Oh, you, uh, as you were telling me before, you also learned a few more dirty little secrets on the, uh, internet about yeah, this game. Most of the slingshots are friggin' garbage. Yeah, so and no more should, slingshots. We should get, uh, like, some proper new bats as soon as possible. We can probably get those once we get the four side, I guess. Uh, I don't need anything else from this douche nozzle. Get our, get our guap and go. Yeah, 4,506. Have you had any real use for money yet? Just buying gear. I mean, have you ever, have you ever even, have you ever had enough inventory space to use a substantial portion of your bank? No. Although that that does make me think that maybe I should we should just call up the uh, the cargo service and have them pick up some stuff. Yes. Uh, come get some some garbage. I want to know how this delivery guy feels about this town. Did it, does this world know about this town? Isn't this like a secret town? 
Well, they're gonna send a delivery guy over, so... I darn sure hope and so. So everyone is just okay with this, you know? <laughs> Crowd like... delivery boy. This town is not okay! <laughs> Alright, sure, Nozzle. I'll take some of my stuff. Uh, I have no need whatsoever of this bicycle. I have... The bicycle sucks. We haven't used it at all. Yeah, you can only use it when you're only... Any... Wait, say again? We haven't crossed any, like, large expanses. Yeah. Uh... Oh man, use some more of that coffee. That was... <laughs> that was trippy. You gonna get effed up on the coffee? Uh, Shove off. That cleared up a little bit of space. We'll probably do that again when we get to town. Yeah! Oh god. I really hope we can skip this. Is it really gonna go through the whole thing again? I'm hitting every button that it's possible for me to hit. This is happening. Remember that time we had to wait for three minutes? Yeah. This is really a great game. <laughs> <laughs> the action is just non-stop in <laughs> the world of Earthbound. I should really look up the thing that lets it, in, it like emulate at double speed or something. Well, put this controller down and I'm going to enjoy an ice cold beverage and I recommend that you do the same. Yeah, so I've you're got not holding it. a controller. Light up a pipe here. Yeah. I uh uh bit the I forgot what I what happened, but I bit the end of my pipe the other day and it's and it sort of snapped the stem, you know. Yeah. So uh I I got a saw out and sawed off the uh I and sawed it until it, you know, down to where it's not broken anymore. Yeah. Then got a file out and carved a little, uh, like a little, um, flange, I guess, on the end. Some little ridges so I can, without lock it behind my teeth. It works just fine. That's pretty I mean, it's not. A, it's not, it, it was better before, but, you know, it's still, it's still capable of, you know, moving air in and out of it, so that's, that's sort of the, uh, idea, right? Yeah, that's like the manliest thing that I've heard of in recent memory. <sighs> so you play any other good games recently? Wait. Wait. Excuse me. Uh, I've been playing some StarCraft 2 lately. The game is... I have a problem with that game in that in single player, hard is too hard, but normal is laughably easy. Yeah. I hate stuff like that. Yeah, they just need, you like, can, you can never find You can never find your, your appropriate area. Yeah. And then I played, uh, I played that online for the first time recently, and god, that was just a nightmare. You can't get into that community. It's like, if you're not already in that community, you, you might as well... Just not even try. Forget it. Yeah. Same. I feel the same way about MOBAs. Like, I'm just... I don't, I don't yeah. feel any need to get abused for playing, playing WoW or LOL or Dota 2 or whatever. So I'm just... I don't want any part of it. Oh, hey, I think this, I think this scrolling... So now pan the camera down onto the Tantive Four fleeing from the Star Destroyer. <laughs> I said pan! Get up into the cavern. Let's uh, talk to a cactus man. I have to see a cactus man about a horse. <laughs> Strutting evil mushroom and his cohorts. Flash him up. And I'm gonna go with Burnham. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> He's 
the Ram Wait. Boob. What, what, was the what was the mushroom's name again? Strut and what? Strut and Evil Mushroom. I like that. Strut and Evil Mushroom and company. <laughs> Offense Earth Mountain is just full of, of good band names and things. Yeah. Flash him. Get him. <sighs> so where do you fall on how powerful we are? Uh, Are we overpowered, underpowered, just about right? I think we're about right right now. For where we are. Because last time we, we were, you know, before we learned the secret about Slime Man. Yeah, we were handling yeah. our business there for a while. I think maybe if I'd, if we'd gone all offense, like if, if Lars had not used up all his, uh, P, uh, his psi power on, um, disabling the HUDs or whatever his name is. Than the barf guy, then we probably would have won. But I want—I want to go to Where the you going? to the uh, hotel so we can sack out. Uh, I noticed that Lars is all almost out of PP. We didn't, we didn't regain it from that. Nope. No butterflies around. No. Man, you got. You guys need some architects in, <laughs> in Saturn. I do want slumber, Ko. K.O. Okay, oh. I'll K.O. you, you little run. <laughs> little bow-wearing bastard. Put on some decent clothes. Get that bow out of your hair. Put on a tie. And get a job. I'm just hanging around in this cave. <laughs> For God's sake, grow some lips. If you notice, they don't have arms, so yet their met their primary method of, of getting around in this town is via ladder. Maybe they just sort of hop from rung to rung. Maybe they have teleportation. Maybe those ladders are ancient relics from the <laughs> civilization that they conquered. That'd be pretty cool. Burn them! Shoot that guy. Burn, baby, burn. Ah, crap. Obviously, he's all mushroomed up. Son of a bitch. Great. No, stop it. These new enemies are annoying, and I want them all to die. They remind me a lot of the old enemies. <sighs> What's up with that gray sprout? Like, it's like they totally ran out of ideas. It's like, it's gray. Just don't color that one. <laughs> What's she going across? Oh, is she po Is that poison? Yeah, we're gonna have to go back again. And we got mushrooms on our heads, so that's gonna be a huge pain in the ass. Then the sweet cure that and just go right back. But you're just gonna have to fight that crap again. It's gonna happen again. Uh, no, I can't, I can't get away because I'm mushroomed. You're ha you're handling this in the worst possible way. But your indecision is going to be your downfall. I didn't mean to go back in. The, the, having the mushroom on your head scrambles your controls. Oh. Yeah, it sucks. Doesn't it just rotate the controller? Yeah, but it doesn't do it in a predictable way. Oh, it, it'll, it'll just rotate it at a random angle? Yeah. A random, uh, what's, what's the term? Like, increment. Like, yeah. it'll rotate 90, uh, 180, or 270 degrees, but it doesn't tell you, and it changes every couple of, you know, every, like, 10 or 15 seconds. So, left is down. Le 
have to stay on. Ah! Whatever, man. Just come back right. Just come back to the. She's gonna die, and then we have to go all the way back to a hospital. Oh. So, at least that's taken care of now. You figure with all these Saturnians advanced technology, they'd have a hospital. Ooh, maybe that maybe that hot springs will take care of this stupid mushroom bullcrap. Just take a sip of that coffee. That'll that'll do it. I appear to have descended below my mushroom, but the screen's getting lighter. Oh, there it goes. There it goes again. What's going on? I hate this town. <laughs> Nothing makes any sense. Oh, controls changed again. I'm gonna go live with the cactus men, thank you very much. I started Find rolling it faster. Good... Find myself a nice strutting mushroom. <laughs> Settle down. No, uh, let me go in! That's what she said. <laughs> that, that, was, that was bad. That yeah. wasn't really good use of that. No. I regret it. Now, yes, well, I'm going to... Should. In my shame, I will... Commit you... seppuku. Good. Okay. On film. <sighs> yeah. I'm sorry, I keep, I keep I'm rotating the controller around trying to figure out what what angle it's on. If they don't have an architect, at least a sign painter <laughs> would be, you know, sufficient. Yes. Not only do I want slumber, I demand slumber. Ooh. Rob Z now has a you're laser gun. It's pretty awesome. You say you're slumming it in this burg. That's also terrible. No, I want to. I'm kill already myself. dead. <laughs> I killed myself after the last joke. Banish your soul someplace. I don't care where. Banish my soul, you say? Yeah. Banish it anywhere but here. So, like, the bathroom? Sure. Put your soul in the toilet. Oh. It's been there for years. <laughs> <laughs> I've always been soul dumping. This is gross. Our, our users will not tolerate this sort of nonsense. Our jokes just aren't very good. Yeah, we're just kind of stupid. Yeah. Ugh. There must be some sort of class I can take or book I can read that, you know, makes me a hilarious comedian. Probably. See if, see if George Carlin's got any of that. Ugh, give me that secret herb, yo. Yes, sell me more secret herb, please. Ugh. So that's... Come on. You, you don't have to say that every time I buy one. <laughs> you know? If you do it nine times out of ten, that's probably sufficient. <sighs> yes, I'd like to sell you something. Okay. Uh huh. Magnum! What? You can't buy it. Buy this gun from me, you son of a bitch! There are no guns in Saturn. It's like California. <laughs> no what guns are some in other Cali places that don't allow guns? Um, Colorado? No, Colorado has guns. New Zealand? I don't know. Well, yeah, all, all of all of the UK. Ouch. Why can't you buy it? Ugh. Just let it go, man. 
Take this slime generator, because the hell with this slime generator. Fine. Whatever. Did, did we use the slime generator for anything? We tried to slow some dudes You're... down once, it was useless. Oh, is that all it, it's not like a quest item or something? No. Yeah, man, use that secret dub. Shit. How do I get rid of this? By the way, we're at the 30 minute mark. I'm not leaving until this mushroom is no longer on my head. Oh, that's cool, just just so you know. Okay. I kind of want to get in, at least into a, a new dungeon before we... Good. Alright. Rob. Smoke this horn of life. On yourself. Damn it! Go, go to the wiki and look this up, because this is intolerable. Oh, yeah. So what, what are we trying to do exactly? Oh, uh, we have the mushroom status effect, and we need to get rid of it. None of these assholes are helping. We're gonna cheat on film. That's right. I'm prepared to take that risk, because just this game's okay. status ailments can suck it. Uh, okay, is it just called Mushroom Status Effect? Yeah. Mushroom... Status... Effect. Oh, wait! I just, I just had to, like, splash around in the... in this oh, thing for it? long enough. Hooray! Alright, now, now we're G'd up. Great. That that must have that status effect must have a different name. I think it's just called mushroom. I looked up mushroom and oh, here we go. Mushroomized is how the oh really the wiki describes it. Okay, you, you go to a hospital, okay. There's a girl hunting mushrooms. Oh, she's take them off your head, too? Yeah, that 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 was a long way to set back, I remember yeah. that. Oh, and the hot springs in Saturn Valley. There you go. There are three ways to remove that status effect, and we... Happen to be 20 feet from one of them. Yeah. So that's cool. You have, to, you have to splash around in the hot springs for a while for it to work. So you can peel off one of these guys to talk. Oh, nope. Come and get it! Uh. So how about that fighting battles? Yeah, how about it? At least it's not scattering spores like an asshole. I'm thinking of pursuing a career in the field of battle fighting. <laughs> you need to learn to do some pull-ups. I'm gonna get a degree in leveling up. <laughs> How many levels do you have in leveling up? It's a four-year program. <laughs> Hooray! Good old Rob Z. How I hate him. <laughs> well, I just, I just, uh, that, that joke, I just found out where that came from the other day. Uh, like, it's from, like, the very first Charlie, uh, Peanuts strip, yeah, isn't the it? Yeah, the very first Charlie Brown comic. There goes good old Charlie Brown. Yep. Good old Charlie Brown. How I despise <laughs> him. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, poor Chili Brown. This comic's- I never found this comic's funny, I always found them horribly depressing. That's kind of it, you know. Is that, that just You have joke? like all these- all these super precocious youngsters that, you know, lead these very depressing lot. Well, it's funny because it's- it's sort of cathartic, you know? Yeah.
At least we're leveling up like friggin' crazy. You level up a few times and you think you're an expert? I'll tell you about leveling up. Please don't. I spent ten years in the trenches leveling up. Oh, shit. No, don't magnetize my size. Use your brain power on them. Earthbound MMO, your thoughts. No, thank you. That is the sum total of my thoughts on the matter. See, so your thoughts on the matter of. I, I elect not to think about that. Yeah. Was that you or was that a slime monster? That was me, sorry. Are you a slime monster? It, it, some parts of my body are slime monster-like. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I got a little slime in me, I'm not afraid to say it. Like, in, in the... In the greater scheme of things, human beings are kind of slime monsters, you know? Yeah. We're, we're a rather turgid slime, but... <laughs> uh, I am a fully erect slime. This should be the name of this episode. <laughs> it's done. You can't undo it now. I done said it. It's beyond anyone's capacity to change now. That's like a fully erect puddle. <laughs> a slime. I am not. Oh. A slime not. A coin of s coin of slumber. Uh, uh, stick that into a payphone and see what happens. Must be equipped as other. Yeah, no shit. Oh, increases Point. your defense and luck. Uh, Maybe it means like a a token of slumber. Oh, I guess so. Maybe so. I just said I guess so. I maybe whatever. Now we're, just, now we're all coined up. As, as qualified in the most indecisive manner possible, yes. <laughs> put put your film on them or something. What does that even do? Call, call down that spinning man from the sky. He knows a thing or two about film. <laughs> That's Dr. Kodak himself. <laughs> the other day in my uh, uh, design writing cri criticism class, yeah. um, one one girl uh, gave a report on uh, Polaroid cameras. Ooh, cool. She did a, a, like, sort of sociological study of Polaroid cameras, and it was pretty interesting. Oh my god. We're like already inside of another boss battle. Maybe it's a... It's a faux boss battle. You're gonna go up there, and you're, it's gonna say you're not ready, because you haven't done something. Alright, well, I've saved our game, just in case. Jump in. Leap this will be the last thing we do. Yeah. We're either gonna win or lose, and either way, we're gonna end, we're gonna end here. Take it from me, if you dare. But, uh, her... Oh, God. That... This just gets worse all the time. <laughs> I... It's some kind of mulch... Animate mulch pile. It's got a yeah, banana mul coming out. Mulch... Mulch would be, you know... You're putting it lightly. <laughs> so... This is all stuff that will... It's got hair. I think this. I think we're fighting fighting a deflated scrotum. <laughs> <laughs> this is the worst thing that's ever happened to anyone. I'm gonna hit him. I'm gonna hit him with the bottle rocket. Get him. Burn him good. Bring out the big guns. Yeah. This yeah, 
Get him with bad. the bottle rocket. He hits I feel like hard. We're doing yeah. pretty well. Naomi needs to. Uh, yeah, we need to. We just step it up. up. Uh. Alpha. Yeah. But um, her report was all about uh, sort of how Polaroid cameras were used in the like in the 70s and so forth as a way of, of documenting like parties and things. Like you would have, they would have things called Polaroid parties. Where they would all get together and and do, do crazy things and snap pictures of them. Huh. It, it kind of ha it, it kind of had the role that a uh, camera phone has now. It's kind of cool. Like people would carry around Polaroid cameras around their necks, even if they didn't have film in it, because it's like sort of a status symbol. It sort of said that yeah, I have things I need to be recording. I'm involved <laughs> in interesting things. Which is kind of like what having a smartphone is now. Yeah. Like, even if you don't have any real friends, you kind of need a smartphone just to tell people, Look you, I have so many, like, social requirements on my time that I need this piece of ridiculously advanced technology to handle it. Oh, crap. Always with the weeping. Ugh. At least, it's, at least you're not possessed. That was the worst. Oh god, yeah, that sucked. Uh, maybe we got some goods that'll take care of this. Of course not. Use the bubble gum. If nothing happens, I'm gonna be pissed. Yeah. Did not become necessary. Hey, let's Holy get a new crap. Point. What? 12,000 experience. Ooh. Wow. 12 new HP. Yeah. Not bad. Ooh, Psy Shield Ooh. Sigma? Yeah, that's a Sigma. That is a capital Sigma. Which is odd, because so far we've had a lowercase Alpha and Beta. Or rather, a minuscule Alpha and Beta, because they didn't have lowercase letters in Greece. Huh. Fascinating. Because they didn't have cases, because they didn't have printing. <laughs> right. Yay! The Melody of the Milky Well. Yes. Okay, check out our our uh, library. Our hot beats. Huh. Oh, okay. I was just saying, you gonna give us a picture for the other ones? Okay, that was a good run. Neat. Let's save here, and uh, yep, we'll call call it a call it a show. We'll catch you later, party people. I think this was probably our most productive show yet. Yeah, we defeated two bosses. Even we... though we we spent a substantial amount of time fucking around in Saturn, <laughs> looking, trying to figure out how to sell a gun to a midget. <laughs> With no <laughs> hands. <laughs> I can't take that gun! <laughs> Maybe that's why. Maybe that's why you couldn't sell it to him. Maybe the designers of this game were just like, "That doesn't make any sense. We're gonna, we're gonna code specifically for that one thing." <laughs> These Saturns want one thing and one thing only, and that's secret herb. They want rings, which is to say, they want to marry you. Oh dear, Andrew, I'm not ready to settle down. That that's that's your cue to skedaddle. Have you ever have you ever seen that Donald Duck cartoon where it's like a diary, Donald Duck's diary, and uh, he 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 like he meets Daisy and she's like husband hungry, you know, and just, and uh, 
So he's, he goes to her house one day, and he's going to propose to her, and he, like, falls asleep in a chair, and then has a dream about married life, and then, uh, it's like a, it's like a nightmare, so he wakes up, and he, like, scrams out of that place, <laughs> and, uh, then at the end, you see him marching back and forth at the top of a, uh, a fort, like in, like he's in the French Foreign Legion or something. <laughs> Out in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Outstanding. This happened, you know, Pokey wanted to get get gay married, and so I had to get out of that, that neighborhood. Yeah. Also, I can't help but notice you started a new battle. Well, you were going to hold forth about something, so I thought I'd make a little more progress back toward town. Oh. Okay. Well, now I'm done. I'm going to eat this butterfly, and then we'll go. Fight that butterfly. Huh. There you have it. We're relaxed. We're done. You're relaxed. Later. We're going to a very calm. We're moving away. Getting softer. You're getting louder. Oh, sorry. <laughs>